One thing that's pretty unknown in the pool industry is using borate in your pool to keep the pH balance, alkalinity balance, which in turn allows you to use a lot less uh, chlorine in the pool. As the pH is stabilized by the borate in the water, you can add it using pure borax. It's a little more complicated this way, or you can use a, a chemical like this pool proof here, which is a hexaborate. So you want to achieve 30 to 50 parts per million of the borate in your water for this to work. And also by having a borate level of 30 to 50 parts per million in your pool, it'll actually make the water more sparkling and actually softer as borate is a water softener. One of the great things about having borate in your water is that it'll eliminate the need for algicides. The borate in the water will act as a natural barrier to protect your pool from algae formation. So you won't need to buy expensive algicides in the summertime or to shock your pool. One of the other benefits of having borate in your pool, it reduces the amount of chlorine you're going to need to use in your pool to sanitize your pool. It says it stabilizes your pH between 7.6 and 7.8. You won't need a lot of muriatic acid also to add to your pool. If you have a salt water pool, this is a great way to stabilize the pH in that particular pool. As you know, as the cell produces the chlorine, the pH also rises. So this is a great way to help maintain your pH level, keep it stable in a salt pool. In the pure borax that you would find at your local store, I got this box at Walmart. It's almost a five pound box of the borax. You can go with this method, but you're going to know you're going to need to use a lot of muriatic acid to balance out the pure borax. And the easy way is just to go with the pool proof here. This hexaborate doesn't raise the pH. It, it'll, you just pour it in and it adds borates to your pool water right away. You're also going to need to invest in a test strip. This one here is by Lamote. And this, you can test the borate levels in your pool. The good thing about adding borate to your pool is that it doesn't evaporate. Also, the only time that you'll lose the product from your water is when you backwash your, if you have a sand filter, if you do a lot of backwashing, splash out, and sometimes the rain water will dilute the amount of borate in your pool. So once you add the hexaborate to your water, or the pure borax, whichever way you want to go, all you're going to need to do in the future is add a maintenance dose to your pool. Okay, it's important to have your pH where you want the level at when you start the borate treatment of your pool. You want to be sure that your alkalinity is also in range also because it's going to be more difficult to lower the pH and alkalinity once you add the borate to your pool since it does uh, keep the pH in balance. Before you add borate to your pool, you want to make sure alkalinity is in balance also. So that's anywhere from 80 to 120 depending on your pool type. This vinyl pool is about 15,000 gallons. So in order to get the borate level where you want it, you can add five bottles of the pool proof, which will bring it to 36 parts per million. And so if you're a new pool owner and not that advanced, I would definitely use the hexaborate. It's much easier to add this chemical versus the pure borax in your pool. There's a chart here, doses chart. It's pretty easy. Basically, every 3,000 gallons, you're gonna need one bottle of the hexaborate. So if your pool is uh, 15,000 gallons, you'll need five bottles of this. With the borax, a little more complicated to measure. I would say for that size pool, maybe 12 to 14 boxes, maybe a case or a case and a half of muriatic acid to balance out the water. And this is a process that takes about two days if you do it with the pure borax method. With the pool proof, it just instantly puts a borate level in your pool without having to do any extra running of the pool equipment. Just to recap the benefits of having a borate level of 30 to 50 parts per million in your pool, whether you're using hexaborate, the pool proof, or using the pure borax, you're going to reduce your chemical usage. You're not going to need to use as much chlorine in your pool. You also will eliminate the use of algicides as the borax is an algae inhibitor. And you also won't need to use as much muriatic acid in your pool as the pH stabilized. So the initial cost of adding borate to your pool is going to be countered by the fact you're going to save money by using a lot less chemicals in your pool year-round. And again, once you add the borate to your pool, it stays in the water, doesn't evaporate, and you'll just have to do a maintenance dose in the future.